632 here on News 8, and police reminding drivers to be extra careful on the roads. 37 million Americans expected to drive at least 50 miles for this coming Memorial Day weekend, of course. That's nearly a 5% jump compared to this time last year. Yeah, and you see Morgan Sturdivant is live along 295 in Portland this morning. Morgan, how's it looking? Hey, good morning, Air to Norm. Well, it's looking pretty good right now. Nice commute for this morning, nice and clear. But you know, these roads are going to be packed later with people coming in the state and people traveling around the state. And police say that's pretty typical. They plan to be out in full force this weekend, keeping people safe. They're asking everyone to be prepared and stay focused. Safe and not distracted. AT&T actually recently released a study about distracted driving, and it's not just texting that's a problem. They say seven in ten drivers use their smartphones while driving to check social media, posting on Twitter, Facebook, or Instagram all while driving. People are even taking selfies and videos while behind the wheel. And police warn this can be deadly. Most importantly, is put the phone down, concentrate on your driving. Uh, like I said, it's going to be uh, highly increased with the volume, and uh, just pay attention to your surroundings, and you'll be fine. And remember, in a split second, it just takes, it just takes a split second for an accident to happen. But AT&T says more than six million people have joined their "It Can Wait" pledge to not use their phone while driving. Police say one thing that can help eliminate the urge to use that cell phone while behind the wheel: plan out your trip and let people know ahead of time when you're leaving. So. Uh, it, plan is to just stay safe out there, stay focused, you'll get there on time, and remember to put these phones down. Live in Portland this morning, Morgan Sturdivant, WMTW News 8.